Good morning everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Jakub Vanish and today we're going to be talking about news in robotics and Android. So buckle up, this is pretty, pretty wild. So there is a company called OneX, OneX Tech, that is introducing a new Android, a new basically housekeeping robot for everybody, a humanoid kind of you know robot, which is called Neo, and they have unveiled quite a lot of things about it. Some some of the videos are looking pretty strange. I think a lot of people were laughing about it uh, on the internet because it looks like a guy in a jumpsuit. It totally does. It's <laughs> pretty strange. However, yeah, I think, you know, if they can actually pull this off, there will be the ones to, who laugh. Unless, you know, um, Elon Musk is able to, to launch his Optimus robots, you know, for uh, for households uh, sooner. Well, we'll have to wait and see. They didn't really announce much about it. They just shown a few, you know, videos of the daily use and some kind of behind the scenes feature. So let's take a look at a few of those. You know, this is this is the first kind of commercial. So you have the lady on a sofa, the robot next to her. You know, they're having a chat. These, yeah, these movements are quite smooth, right? So he gave her the the back or the purse. Look at this, like these are, okay, and this, this <laughs> thing is killing it, right? And here they are next to each other, he's waving at the camera, so, okay, and that's, you know, I saw a post where somebody, you know, said something about, because this is quite a small robot, I think it's like five foot four or something like that, and somebody was commenting, if they made the robot 6.1 inches, uh, six, uh, six feet one, birth rates would drop to zero. <laughs> I don't know about that, but... Uh, but it was a funny comment. So there's another video that we found. Okay, here he's manipulating some some bike. Then he's ironing a shirt, I guess. Okay. And polishing stuff, grounding coffee, preparing a coffee, but like it's not just an espresso machine, right? Like this is this is uh, some Italian stuff. So that's pretty hardcore. Okay, if that's true, that, that would be really amazing. But uh, there is not much, you know, about this, in let's say, in terms of pricing and when is it coming right, uh, out. So if I take a look at their website, this is how it looks like. Neo is your intelligent everyday assistant. Join the waitlist and be the first to know when Neo is available. Okay. It looks like they're trying to get some funding, you know, from investors. Neo's vision and movement can be quickly taken over by a remote human operator if you need support. Okay. Neo's body is engineered with muscle-like anatomy instead of rigid hydraulics, so they're strong and gentle like we are. Neo can walk, jog, climb stairs and navigate your space naturally as they move and perform tasks. They get even more efficient. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, 5 point 41 feet okay 66 pounds it's pretty light to be honest the walk speed is 2.5 miles per hour so that's kind of regular 7.5 miles run speed that's really impressive i have to say and also the carrying uh, capacity 44 pounds that's pretty impressive that it can carry that much runtime 2.4 hour per day so that should be enough so okay these are the news that we got about this do you think it's fake uh it totally looks like a guy in a jumpsuit as you look at the boots and especially the legs um yeah i don't know <laughs> i don't know if this is an actual you know robot most likely it is but i think honestly they will not really make it to the market and if they will it's probably gonna be niche I, i'm much more betting for elon musk's you know tesla optimus robot to take over the world sooner but we'll have to wait and see, you know, these, uh, there's definitely going to be a demand for these type of robots, especially as the population is, is getting older. Um, so, yeah, let me know what you think about it in the comments. If you want to help me out, please, you know, hit a like button or the subscribe button. That, that affects that YouTube algorithm just the right way. Otherwise, I wish you an amazing day. And this has been Jakub Vanish. Take care, everybody, and cheers. Bye-bye.